Hi, I'm Matthew Chikella, the writer and director of God's Not Here. I've been a filmmaker for a little over 10 years now, but the road here has not been easy. It's been filled with hard work, dedication, and most of all, a lot of faith. You see, when I was growing up, I was told by almost everybody that surrounded me that I was a daydreamer. I had my head in the clouds. I would never amount to nothing. After all, I was a young kid in Rockford, Illinois, with aspirations of making films in Hollywood. What's the likelihood of that happening? But here's the thing. It can happen as long as you believe in it. And I'm here to tell you that's exactly what happened with me. You see, my high school principal brought my parents to her office simply to tell her to just cast me away that I was never going to amount to anything. Now, instead of being devastated by this information, which I felt was very unprofessional and very discouraging for a young mind, what I did was I left that school, went to an alternative school, and I did four years of high school in a year and a half. The cherry on top was I then went to college and got a business degree. I got a business degree so I could apply it to the one thing I wanted to do, and that has never submit entertainment. That's my company that makes motion pictures. You see, in 2011, I made my first feature film. It was a psychological thriller with some faith-based inspiration, but I wasn't exactly fulfilled with that movie. Uh, I settled down. I got married to help my wife raise her kids. Life took a different path for me. Fast forward eight years later, I found myself alone in my house, wondering and questioning where I'd gone wrong in life, what had happened, why was I being punished for being a good person. I believed I did everything right. And then it occurred to me, I wasn't being punished. I wasn't alone. God was always with me, and this was just another test, the trials and tribulations we all must go through. And it wasn't easy to accept that, but wouldn't you know, once I stop being angry and stop being hateful to what the situation I found myself in I was blessed beyond belief within six months I was on set making a new feature film called Without Grace a faith based movie for believers and non-believers the momentum never slowed down right after that I've done three movies including two faith based movies God's Not Here and Trial by Faith I continue to carry the word of Christ with everything I do in life. It's not because my life's been easy and grand and there's no pain or anguish. I mean, I've been through a lot. I have lost so many loved ones way too early. But here's the thing. The most important thing in your life has to be the faith and love that you have for God and Jesus Christ. Because as long as you have that, you are never alone. And that was the most important thing that I needed to realize. And once I realized that, I swear to you, life has been so much better. Yes, I still have bad days. I still go through heartbreak. I still go through triumph. But if you remember, the greatest story ever told was filled with heartbreak and triumph. And of course, I'm talking about the resurrection of Jesus Christ. So if he can go through that, then I can go through anything.